Hello and welcome back to my Craft the World Let's Play series, where in this episode we are picking off, I think, a second <laughs> from where we left off in the last episode with this goblin surprise attack. Great. But I think all of our dwarves, or most of our dwarves, are um, okay. Okay. I take that back. Okay, some of them, two of them are a little bit hurt, three of them are just a tiny bit hurt. I think we can... Um, I think we can manage. So let's order an attack here. Yeah, the ones with low health just really have to retreat back to um to base. And then after this, we just have to quickly, quickly get everyone to sleep. So let's get rid of these, this ugly guy in the tent, and the. Camp. Right, there we go. Good. We also got some feathers and some paint. Good. Okay. Phew. Now. Um pause action. One second. Because what we need to do now is to get everyone to bed. We also have to unpause. Get that done. Um one sad thing. We do not have any fire arrows. For the month. Oh wait, we do have 22. Okay. Um, you know what? I'll let everyone do their thing, and then I'll send them to bed, and then they will just have to wake up once I order them all to get um, to get to one specific place. So go rest. Uh, you're fine. Go rest. Go rest. Go rest. You go, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. Go rest, go rest. Okay, good. So we have um, a couple of them sleeping. There we go. And the rest of them are working. And we're done up here. Let's gather this water here. Gather water. Gather water. Okay. No water to be gathered anymore. Good. Um, did I place that? Yeah, I think I did. Okay, let's put that away. And let's think. Can we get fire arrows made in one minute? Someone please go make them. Yes. Yes, perfect. Because they are very quick to, um, to make and our archers are going to need them. Um, this is our farm area over here. I had a few ideas since the last episode. Um, and also we need to set up some traps and stuff like that. But we'll do that after our headache is over. <laughs> Actually, that went really fast. Let's make 40 of those. And hopefully someone will go do that. I think we also need some windows up here. But again, we'll do all that in due time. Um, what are you doing over here? You are going all the way over here to collect those. I'll make a portal for you then to make everything easier. I'll leave this sheep and this, um, well, yeah, this sheep because we can capture it. Actually, um, dude, yes, good. Disable that portal. Okay. All the fire arrows are done. Question is, where are they going to spawn? Where will the portal spawn? Um, come on, get the rest of them. Get the rest of them. We need all of them. We need all of them. Okay. Where are you going? No. No, you're not. No. <laughs> what are you doing? No. Do not do that. I'll um, make a portal here. Okay, I'll unpause, make a portal, pause again, and then call everyone back here. So that everyone out of bed, everyone get back, you're crazy, get back, and where is this portal going to spawn? Okay, to the left, that's good. 
because that's where all of our defenses are. So, so far only a couple of zombies and some skeletons. A big zombie, not a problem really. Then we have an archer, that's fine. Okay, this might be an issue. Let's quickly equip our archers or allow our, our archers to use the fire arrows like so, like so, like so. And you know what? We have a little bit of armor. Let's equip it to those who do not have any. So that's at least better than nothing. So actually I'll give it to those who are, um, who are swordsmen because they are going to be up front and they are going to need as much as much protection as they can possibly get. So like so, I only have a chest plate for you, only have a chest plate for you. Okay, good. So, what did he, oh, oh yeah, um, they're firing zombies and stuff at us. We also have a pretty powerful skeleton here and okay. Yeah. So, okay. This is going to be an intense battle, I think, this one. <laughs> I hope we can do it. I think we can, anyway. We should be able to. Our dwarves are strong. Get him. Get the big guy, too. Come on, get him. Get him. Get him, we can take him. Yes, and the last zombie. We defeated the... Is it the fourth or fifth monster wave? <laughs> I can't remember anymore. But anyways, we defeated it. They took down, I think, two or three of our defenses. Defense. But um, I think that's fine. We didn't lose anyone, so that's good. And you can stop using fire arrows now, people. So let's let's um, equip those. Uh, let's go that and that. Good. Which leaves us plenty of time to work on the home. So I didn't even have to use my fire spell, but I'm sure we will in due time. So we got another rune. I'm just trying to find the wooden spikes here. I want an extra wooden spike. Uh, two, I'll take two. And yeah, we do want some more traps, but oh, we have everything for a trap. Okay, let's do that then. And let us, let us put down three, like so. And then we're good for now anyway. So down here, I was thinking, first of all, we need to have some torches out. So let's put down a torch here, then a torch here, and then a torch here. Yeah, that's good. And get rid of that because actually, okay, can I do that? That needs to be removed first. And let us um, do this build earth because then I will make another area over here. But then since it's very close to the edge, I think I will use this special stone that we got unlocked this one stone wall but it's going to require I think it requires the stoneworks um, so I think I will be using those as I might actually be um, converting all of the stone into that we'll see um, yeah now we can put that there good and now everyone is going going over here great let's do that and let us you know what, let's put a trap down here, as we do want that sheep in our farm. And then we want this to be dug out, like so. As we do need all of the, um, all of the coal anyway. Yes, good. Because now, what I then can do is take these grains. Let me just take a look here. Grain is extracted from ears of ripe wheat, can be processed into flour or planted. So that's what we are going to do. So we just click on the ground and then they will sow it. So like so. 
and then I'll do the same up here, I think. I think I might put the start of it at something like here. So let's put a stone here, a stone here, and then get rid of that and put a stone there. Get rid, get rid of that. And no, not replace sand. Let's nope, no. Get nope. Take that. And we need some nice wooden um some nice wooden background as well. Yeah, I know you can't dig that. So let's get rid of that too, and the snail. And let's just make this look a little bit nicer around these parts. So there we go, it's now growing. We can also do this, replace earth. And we can also just, okay, actually first, yes, we can now say, um, catch. And a dwarf will come over, put it in a bag. <laughs> crazy enough and then put it into um, our farmhouse over there so let's do that do we have any other hello there um, let's get sheep and when we do have um, once we get two of one animal then we'll be able to um, then we will be able to then they will reproduce, that's actually what I'm trying to say. They will reproduce and we will get more animals. Okay, I need a bunch of these. Literally a bunch. So I'll do that, um, like so. And I will also need my scaffoldings. Where are they? They're somewhere around here, I know it. Because I need to fix that up here. Let's let's put stone there for now. I, I think I will use that fancy stone. And speaking of, oops, wrong button. Let us make a stone workshop. So for that we need a stone and we need a large table. We need an iron pickaxe, obviously, because they need to use something to cut the stone. And then wood, wood. There we go. And it's an instant craft thing. So let's put that up here right there and I think I'll keep I'll just use one for now let's then use um, replace earth and I'll do all these um, I think I'll just cut that part out okay that was a lot of clicking so let's also get rid of these this unfortunately have to be um, it has to be dirt Otherwise, this cannot grow, and I want this to be another, um... Oh, there's the sheep. And let's see, did they catch this one? Not yet. Come on. Come on. Nice little trap waiting for you. Come on. Yes. Let's then catch it, and then get the trap. And did they get the other trap? No. Let's destroy that, or mine that. Dig that. And let's also replace earth and also replace earth because then eh, I'm not going to put it all there. I'm also going to need more. Um, well, we do need a mill actually. We need a mission up here. Let's make a portal like so. Make it really long because they are going to need it. Because I want all this water gathered and moved out of the way. And then I want them to start digging down this mountain here. Um, we can also extend this portal time here and then do some digging as well here. So do this. After a few episodes or many episodes, this mountain might very well be gone. Okay, so they're working on that. We also want some dirt in our inventory, and I can remove these scaffoldings now. I think I'm going to, for the first time, to buy something in Grunt's shop. And what I'm going to buy is, if I can find it, I want to buy, please tell me he has it, um, there, I want these. 
We have 29 gold coins. I think I'm going to buy 10. Okay, 15. So that's all the way over here. We can put a portal here. And then some dwarves will come and pick those up. So we don't have really have anything else to use this for. Um, so we might as well. Let's put it here. Actually, I want that coal. So dig that first. And I want another one of these actually. No wait, I wanted to make the I wanted to make the mill. There. Mill. But I need I need more stone. I need more stone. So while that happens, I need I'm losing track here. One second. Um I need the grains. I need the grains. Yes. Like so. So here we go. Put that there. Yeah, you fell. Um, let's mine that. Like so. Doing good. Oh, another coin. Lovely. So we can now put more down here. So let's actually do all that. Let's remove the torch and put more of that. Put more of that. And we'll get the torch placed up here. And we can then say replace, actually replace earth. There we go. Some thunder going on. And then we can get grains put down uh -oh. here. Uh oh, uh oh, what? It's going to look a little ugly with, um, with like the dirt here, but that's something we just have to wait and we'll just have to uh, live with it. So replace that. Replace earth. Yes, you can. You just don't know how to yet. So let's replace coal. Everything is going nicely so far. I hope someone has been to the... Yes, they have. So now we can make a mill. So I don't understand why, like for these, you cannot just put stuff in, but I don't know, maybe it's maybe it's something that you have to do, a recipe that you have to do a certain amount of times before it um, comes with it, I don't know. Anyways, that, have to be, that has to be made or crafted. And we can now put grains in here, good. And I kind of want to seal this off here. Just to make it look nicer. So let's get the stone here. Instead of the... No, I need the dirt. There we go. And... Like so. And... Yeah, that's going... That's, that'll do. Let's do this. Replace front earth. Replace front earth. Replace front earth. There we go. Very nice indeed. We can now start placing this down here. Like so. And I guess we'll make this into stone as well, replace front earth. And you know what, let's do this too. Why not? Um, yeah, doing good. Wait, why not? Cannot reach? Now you can. Replace front earth. Good. So that's getting fixed. Also, I want this to be stone as well. So let's just um, do that. And replace front earth, replace roots, replace front earth, replace front earth, replace front earth. For now, anyway, I might change it to the um, special stone. Do we then have now the mill? Because... Where is it? Wrong place. Wrong place. Yes, we have the mill. Let us then put that down over here. Oh, that's small. Wait, we have two mills? I didn't order two mills, did I? That might have been a bug. Anyways, um, I'll put the mill down over... There, yeah, that looks stupid. Let's put it here in the corner, right there. Good. And we need a grain on the last one. So let us get the last grain. Uh, where is it? 
Where is it? There we go. And do that. Yeah, and we can do that one too as well. So we don't need that anymore. No, do we need that? Is the sheep captured now? Yes, it is. Let's kill those guys. And let us also do a catch. Apparently no one has done that yet. So beat up the zombies. Nice job. And yes, we're under attack over there. We're still at a comfort level of good 65%, which is amazing. Let's do that. It is a little bit dark over here, I find. Should I extend it one? And then put a torch. I think I'll extend it one. And then I'll say replace run earth, replace run earth. Or roots. Or whatever it is. And so do that. Also we need a torch here. So like that. I just find it very dark over here. So I just want a torch right here. Okay. Good job. We don't need those anymore. And guess we can order a torch to be put down here as well. Like so. Good. Um, we also need, oh well, we need more food on the tables. So let's do that. Let's put this away, put that away, put that away, and put that away for now. And let's get the food out. We have grilled meat, we have fried eggs, we have fish stew and grilled fish, and also still some salad. Which we do need more of, so let's make a bunch of that. So let's do, let's start with two of each on each table. So like that, and then we need the salad. One, two, so two of this, no, no, two, select, select, two, 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 and not that, fried eggs, that, that. There can be a lot of food on these um, tables. So I'll fill the rest with fish stew, as that is what we have most of. So let's get rid of that again, like so, like so, and like so. Good. Now, just for the last grain, oh, wrong button again. I keep pressing the wrong things. Um, the last grain here is to be put down. Let's put that away again. And we actually do need the wood there at the end. Now, one thing I do want to do again, so replace with, replace with, or not again, but something I want to do is that I want to, put the scaffolding there, I want to make a training area, and I think I'll do that on top of here, actually. Um, I can always move it, so let's take a look at the stuff here. Also, I need more helmets. Do we have more items for helmets? Let's make two of those and let us equip those actually. So let's see. We have this guy who needs a helmet and we have this guy needs a helmet. Okay, everyone have hel has helmets now. So everyone have helmets. Good. Let us now just focus on the boots and then our archers will get last. Yeah, if I'm thinking of get rid of those, please. Of making ladders here and then make another section. So let's see, what do we have for resources? We have wooden hatches, good. We do have the ladders, perfect. Have everything required. So let's make a ladder here and can I place a ladder there for some reason. Hmm. Wait, actually remove ladder then, and then place it at the edge here, like so, and get rid of that. And then equip the wood, like so, just to put here, and then I need to find the, there we go, training dummy. So we need for that wheat, we have some wheat here, that leaves wheat, then we need planks, I'll make one of each I think leather and steel because what we can use these for is to um, increase our fighters and archers in um, in their skill 
So we need dice, then we need planks, and then planks as well. There we go. Advanced weaponry is almost done. What can we do to make it m more done? <laughs> I'm not quite sure actually. Let's um. Well, we can make a parachute. We can make a magic sphere. You know what? I think it will complete once those two are done. They, I don't think there are anything that I really want from it anyway. At this time anyway. So let's just keep it at that and let's place a hatch right there. And get it out of my inventory. And then we just have to wait for these to be crafted. Okay, we're doing good. Um... In the next episode, I think we will do some woodworkings and maybe replace like stuff like this and um, get it to look nice, nice. So let's do this, build stone, build stone. And um, yeah, some of the wheat is already ready for harvest. And please tell me someone catch that sheep. Yes, good. Remove trap and get this here and get the trees and actually punch a hole through that. Good. And get the slime. And do that too. Good. Very good. I also want to build a bridge here eventually. So like here, eventually. Um, so that will also be a thing that I want to do. We also need one last ladder. Right here. So put that there. Good. Put that away and put that away. Good. I think once this one is complete... We're good. Oh, it is. It is. Well, then we need to make some something more. Um, let's make the grinding stone. Not that I'm going to use it really. It, it just increases the sorts, the warrior skill. I think it is. There we go. Now we completed it. What did it unlock? Expert armor. Are you kidding me? We just com <laughs> we just completed the other one. Okay, that's that's fine. Steel armor, so that is just armor with steel. Um, how much steel do we have? We need more steel, actually. Um, let's make a bunch. Let's just use up all the iron, actually. There we go. Um, okay. Yes, get working on that. Um, oh, I just can get the leather armor then. <laughs> um, diving helmet. A diving hammer helmet allows dwarves to work on the water without time limits. Good. Because I need stuff done down here, I think. Um, I want to fill some of this up, I think. So we can have, like, equal area, maybe. Okay, get that out of the way. And also, do place down the grain here. There we go. Lovely. Let's put that away. And let us put down these, just for now. Because then we can train our warriors. They, this will be in an enclosed area. I might do some of the some of it off camera actually. But um, you know what? I think this will do it for this episode. We also want some um, windows down here and up here as well. And then we want to make this into a proper um, proper floor. So I think we can say no, don't mind it. I think we can select dwarf. So this, if we just, um, hold on, select dwarf. We need to know who's a warrior. So if we take, let's take, uh, who's this? Select dwarf, Hain. Let us take a look at him. I think it's our first one, actually. Yeah, this is our first dwarf. He's a miller. Question is, what happens when we say train? No combat skill. Great. So he needs a warrior skill. Which we actually can give him. I think. So let's give him a warrior's book. And let's see if anyone... Yeah, Reen doesn't have it either. So let's give him that. And then... Hain. Go train, buddy. And I think you... I just want to move you a bit. Watch and learn. Just want to see him train. Yes. And then he will increase his level. That's cool, actually. That's really cool. You'll practice that too. Yes. You missed. <laughs> okay. With all this done and said, 
I think I'm going to end this episode here. We defeated the monster wave with ease, even though we got surprise attacked by an, a, a, um, a goblin army anyway, but we defeated them because our, our dwarves are strong. They are strong and they are training now, which is perfect. So, with all this said, I hope you enjoyed and if you did, remember to leave a like, comment and share it with your friends. And if you are new to the channel, remember to subscribe. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. He's just about getting... Yes. He got an extra skill, I think. Uh, who is this? Lorne. If we take a look at Lorne. Lorne. Yes, his archer skill is now at 13. Perfect. And his will be at 11 soon. Alright. I'm gonna stop talking and end the episode. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.